Now I'm going to tell you something that might surprise you. This might surprise you guys. Hi, it's Lee from the Japanese Water Gardens. Clearly I'm not at the Japanese Water Gardens today. It's the evening and I've come out to a, a pond that's not far from where I live to do a quick video about the nitrogen, the nitrogen, nitrogen cycle. The nitrogen cycle. The nitrogen cycle. Yeah. Why do you need a pond filter when this pond, which is hundreds of thousands of gallons, doesn't seem to have a filter? And if I can make Ruby understand about the nitrogen cycle, then anybody will understand it. <laughs> the fish expels something through the gills and it's called... Ammonia. Ammonia. But fortunately, nature has provided a solution and it's called the nitrogen cycle. Poisonous. Yep. It can damage the gills, yep. the fins, yep. the... It can get parasites or something. I can't. Yeah, it weakens the immune system. It leaves them susceptible to problems like parasites and bacteria infections. Millions and millions of bacteria that are growing in there are doing the same job that your filter system is doing in your pond. It's very simple. Fish expel ammonia through the gills. It's a byproduct of the respiratory cycle. That ammonia, if it's allowed to become concentrated, would very quickly poison the fish. It would burn the gills, it would damage the fins, and it would very quickly become extremely unwell. But fortunately, nature has provided a solution, and it's called the nitrogen cycle. It's quite simple. The fish expel the ammonia, and then bacteria, which is growing in the pond, breaks that ammonia down into something called nitrite. A second type of bacteria converts that into something called nitrate. And then these plants take up the nitrate, they use it as a food source, as a fertilizer, and that maintains the water quality in the pond. You might think that a filtration system is all about giving you clarity. In reality, the clarity is only a small aspect of it. The main function that a pond filter has is to prevent the ammonia in your pond becoming concentrated. And it does that through the nitrogen cycle. Surprisingly, this water in this pond is relatively clear. It's clear because there's a balance. There isn't an abundance of nutrients. The nutrients are being taken up by the plants. Oh, I'm gonna fall. These smalls are so tiny. Do not even go down there, George. Right, Ruby, you're going to tell everybody about the nitrogen cycle. Okay. Get started. Right. In this pond, there are... Something. Like a hundred of fish, right? There's a lot of fish in there. A lot it's of a fish. fishing pond near to where we live, this one. And that is something called ammo ammonia. Yeah. And that is poisonous. If it's concentrated, it can damage the gills, it can damage the fins, it can have parasites, or something to do with the immune system. Did you say like millions of bacteria in yeah. the pond? Now, the reason that you can have a pond like this. And there are literally hundreds and hundreds of fish in this pond. And you not require a pond filter is dead simple. The concentration of fish is very low. There are thousands, hundreds of thousands of gallons in this pond, but there is only a relatively low number of fish. Now most people, most people, Ruby, in a garden pond have far more fish than what nature can provide the filtration for. Nitrate is an amazing fertilizer for the... I don't know. For the plants. The trouble is, in most ponds, you don't have plants. 
in most garden ponds because people are concerned about the fish just uprooting them. Now I'm going to tell you something that might surprise you. This might surprise you guys. In most ponds, in my opinion, the biggest challenge is not actually the removal of the ammonia and the nitrites. The biggest challenge is actually the mechanical filtration. It's the dirty muck that clogs everything up. Dirty muck. The dirty muck. So for most people, the biggest challenge that they face is not the removal of the ammonia and the nitrites, it's actually maintaining the water clarity. Nobody wants And extra that is a rocks. subject that we'll have to do in another video, Ruby. Okay, another video.